man is hot. I'm trying to look at the GPS to see how I could get there. What is up, you guys? I hope you're having a wonderful day. Now, well, today's vlog is gonna be a special vlog for you guys because some of you have requested for me to do the Southern Regis. And today, I'm gonna do the Southern Regis. And we're gonna see the Henderson Wave. Now, if I wanna be honest with you, I am not very excited or excited about this place. Because there's gonna be a lot of uphill climb under this hot sun and of course there will be stairs. There will be lots of stairs. First stop, Hot Park Garden. Ooh, look at this place. A lot of farming going on here. A lot of plantation. Hmm. They have a little kids' playground over here. Dream guys, dream. Oh no, uphill already. I tell you guys, this vlog, today's vlog, I don't think anyone wants to do it. Not Chloe, not Vic, not Cass. I don't think even Shaq wants to do this. Probably Nathan. The only one I can think of is Nathan. But Nathan, Nathan is busy because he has to work for Angel. And Angel got stuff for him to do. So he's not able to join me on this one. Woo! Woo, it's hot. It is very hot. Oh. To tell you honestly, today's vlog was this close to not happening because the haze is back. Yes, guys, the haze is back in Singapore. In the morning, it was like 90 something, but now it has gone down to 60. And yes, that's why I'm back out here again, doing this adventure for you. So we are heading to this bridge to continue our path. it's all broad walks but it is hot it is seriously very hot for those of you who are afraid of height i got news for you it's pretty high here so we just passed the alexandra bridge and now we are at toloplanga hilltop park it is a hill <sighs> look at this guys i'm not even kidding but uh, look More walking. So it is about a 10 kilometer walk from where I started all the way to the end. I think I've already done like two kilometers. So far, so good. There is no stairs at the moment. I haven't encountered any stairs. It's just steep, broad walk that is sloped up. So I'm quite high on the top right now. As you can see, I think we are probably like the 15th story of a building or something. There's still more uphill to go. Deeper into the jungle. Wow, wow. It has been this metal broad walk for a while. Way too long. And as you guys can see, up the hill over there and up there as well. Okay. However, I think there's a little shortcut here. Look at this. I have to get up to that bridge there by going this way and up this way. But there seems to be stairs going up that way. So I think I'm going through the jungle. Shortcut, I hope. I'm not sure if this is a shortcut or not, but Fingers crossed! I think so. I think it is. Yeah, but look at this, guys. Look at that. Lots of fallen leaves. And up the stairs there. I think it'll connect me back to this broad walk. Let's go. Now obviously, you knew I had to go down and come back up again to do that shot, right? Anderson Wave over there. Now I wonder if they allow Freddy or Frankie here because it would have been so much easier. But so far I haven't seen a sign saying no e-scooter or boards allowed because down here there's no bicycle lanes and all. There's only walkways. So I doubt that we are allowed to ride here. Well, it's downhill now. A lot easier. Henderson Wave. Woo. It's not yet. Not yet. Still a distance. What is this? 
Mm, let's check it out. Look at this. Up here, there is a house. Wow. Wow, guys. Look at that mansion. The sign outside says that this place is going to open in April or May this year, which is pretty soon. We'll check it out when it's open. Still on construction at the moment. I'm running out of water. Oh, awesome. Just what I needed, a water cooler. I can't fill it up full, but that should be enough. Okay, this is the end of Tolublanga Hill Park. And more uphill. Ah! This is this is not easy guys. This is not easy. <laughs> There's so much uphill. I tell you guys, I tell you what I need now. I need to soak into the pool on the pool bar, sipping margaritas, and then probably get a massage in the pool. And yes, finally I made it to the Henderson Way. a lot of people on one bridge. That's my honest opinion. So as you can see from the map, that's the southern ridges. We've completed it. Now we're gonna head to Mount Faber. So over here, going through Mount Faber, I'll be able to head back home when I reach to Helperfront. That's where Vivo City is. Yes, that's why every time it's Vivo City. But I need to go there to get the train or the bus. So here's my take on the southern regions. Everything is nice and beautiful, but if you want a real hike, then probably I would say Coney Island would be a much better choice. I gotta head back now. And I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. I will see you in the next one. You guys keep smiling. See ya. Oh no, oh no. There's dark clouds behind me and it's starting to drizzle. I have to get to this train station as soon as possible. It's coming guys, the rain is coming. Oh my. This here on top of me, it's not very good shelter. Rain still goes through. So, whew, the rain has stopped. Finally the rain has stopped. It was like a 15 minutes downpour shower. And now I'm on the way to the MRT. I'm pretty sure I can make it this time. Oh no, it's gonna rain again. Uh, gotta hurry, gotta hurry. But this is the route I'm taking. Should be safe. I better keep a lookout on where I'm walking because I don't want to sprain my ankles again like last time at McRitchie. If you guys remember that, I sprained my ankles when we did the McRitchie trails. And I'll leave a link here if you want to watch that one. Where is the MRT? See, guys, do I go here or do I go here? There's no sign. I tell you guys, Freddy, Freddy won't make it here. I'll end up carrying Freddy most of the time. There is too much stairs here. Look at this. Nearly there guys, nearly there. I can see it. I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. The light to freedom. All right, I made it. We're done, we're done. 10 kilometer plus. I don't really know the distance, but I read it's about 10 kilometers in four hours. Plus filming, sounds so shit, right? Four hours for 10 kilometers. Rene, I have never been so happy to be back at Vivo City. Woo! Every day, Vivo City. Ah, finally, some air condition.